don't be alarmed or be alarmed because I'm kind of alarmed just like looking at myself right now. Yes, I got an airbrush tan. That's completely besides the point. This is kind of like the point before I wash it off. So I look very dark right now. And like everywhere I have gone, mainly the tanning salon itself, they're like, oh, your color is so amazing. And I'm like, really? Or do I look completely unnatural? Reason I got this tan and it is relevant not the tan, but the reason is that I am going out of town. And during that trip, I'm going to hopefully see some of you guys in Houston, Texas. And also I'm going to see my brother in Cabo. Since I've been in the house editing videos and I am not as fit as I usually am, it's, you know, tone up or tan up. So that's what I'm doing. I swear I'll look normal later. Here's what's happening that I find is very important to alert you of. One awesome thing are 100 thousand video special because I'm gonna be gone and because like I just got overloaded with work from YouTube believe it or not even though you know I still I have hundreds of videos like I film and I just can't get them out my friend Chris Schwab is going to edit the special for you so even though I'm gonna be gone out there visiting you guys and in Cabo at some point I will still be able to get the video out without me spending this whole week not editing it Two. Something is happening right now. My friends are coming over because they want to continue to help me find Picasso while I'm away. And I just think that is so amazing and so sweet. So I'm gonna be giving them some flyers where they can plaster everywhere while I'm gone. So you guys know that we're still looking for Picasso. I'm continuously looking for Picasso. Somebody sent me an email today. There is a bird at the Burbank shelter. It's not open today. Kevin's gonna go there tomorrow because Kevin is such a good friend. And on top of that, my two friends, Harmony and Sierra, are going to be plastering the posters everywhere. And then another lead, some kid contacted me and said that a bird was landing on their heads at their school. So I called the school today, they didn't know anything about it, but it literally, like, you never know, it's not so far away. I'm like, either they want a YouTuber to show up at their school, or they're legitimate and saw my flyer. So Jenna's gonna go there, and if you're wondering about all the animals, George's mom is gonna watch the birds, because she's amazing with them, and Jenna is going to be watching Starbucks and Stanley, and Pastel and Sandy. Jenna is gonna come every day and take care of the lizards, as I call them, which is the chameleon and the gecko. And she's going to keep Sandy and Starbucks with her, which she's really excited about. So Sandy and Harry and Starbucks will all be together. And by the way, my room looks so clean right now. Except for, what is this? Oh, okay, a bag of tissues. Dang, I look dark. Okay, so my friend's gonna come over. I'm gonna give her the flyers and maybe they'll send me some footage of them looking for Picasso. I do believe that they are making their own Instagram show. I don't know. I'll find out more when I see her and then I'll let you guys know because you'll find out with me. Oh my God, I do look insane. A side note, reason that I got this airbrush tan instead of going in the tanning beds for obvious reasons. This is made out of like some sort of walnut spray and it's healthy and you know, I'm not getting like, tanning can be dangerous, I think. Starbucks, come here. Come here, come show everybody how much sun you have in your like spot. Come on, come on, come on. Ah! My phone just fell. <laughs> come here, it's like, I don't even know if it's upside down. Come here, Starbucks, come show everyone. Anyway, I know you guys watched the video of me setting this up, but isn't it so cute by the window? Oh yeah, bathroom looks so much better now. It's like. My bathtub is literally for laundry. Anyway, guys, let's literally hang out with my babies because it's fun. They're so cute. Oh, oh and uh, Cody obviously took a bath in his water. And yeah, because he does that, and then I have to fill it and clean it like three times. Let's see who else is in here. <gasps> Superstar Jersey. Hey, guys, you know what this is from? Kevin. Do you guys remember Kevin with Marley? I'll say that, but you guys know exactly who Kevin is. When I first met Kevin in the bird store, the perfect parrot, he bought this for Jersey. He was like, I really wanna buy Jersey a present. And like, I just met him. 
So we bought that for Jersey. Jersey's getting excited. And then guess where Vinny is? Have you guys guess? Look at this little tail here. What are you doing? Are you trying to escape? And then there is my little baby Leo. Look. Jersey's all wet because of the mister. <laughs> look at her feathers. They look worse than they are. It's just because she's wet. You're wet. No, not on that. You can't be like on this right now. Help! Oh, look at the sun illuminating my 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 Leo. Jersey? What do you think? Does mommy look a little different? I love you. I love you. I'm gonna have footprints on my skin. Uh oh. How do I explain that? Uh, yeah. Okay, so I have birdie footprints on me. Do you think that it's gonna stay that way? <laughs> I don't know. Hey guys, I just want to tell you something. I like to express myself through my nails. Can anyone guess who these nails pay tribute to? Guess who? George, my African Grey. Basically, today, as you're watching this, and I'm praying I get this up today. I had so many meetings today, but today as you're watching this, August 28th, ah! The cat just crawled up on me. August 28th is the anniversary of George's death. It's about four years ago that he died now, which reminds me, in four years, that comment's still bothering me. Somebody said I keep getting birds. In four years, I got two birds. One kind of like not took the place of George, but I already had that, and one you guys got me. So it's just kind of a ridiculous comment. I hate things without like information or background it's not like you see me running around getting birds like obviously but this hand is all gray with one red nail that's his gray body with his one red feather he had a red feather on his tummy and this is his red tail and this one white one is to signify his white toes so i love to do that with my nails for my birds i do it differently for him every year. One year I got all black and um, I got a feather on it for him. And another year I did all red nails with some gray. So you can do it however you want, but I hope I inspire you to do nails based off of your birds. It's something that I love to do. If you saw, I've been doing the Picasso as of late and after the anniversary of Georgia, I'm definitely gonna do the Picasso again because I liked it and I haven't found him yet. So that is it. That's my um, little personal nail thing. Mm, I'm very heartbroken over my bird. Oh look, my phone films me consistently without me turning it on. It's like a stalker phone. Okay guys, Harmony is here, dun dun dun, making me look even darker than I was. There's Rocky. Harmony is here because she's gonna pick up some flyers to find Picasso. I feel I can't take myself seriously. Tell us about your show that you're gonna start on Instagram. Okay, so our show is gonna be called City of Angels and we're gonna be doing good deeds for people in Los Angeles. One of our good deeds is gonna be to help Marlene find Picasso. Yay! Yay! So you see guys, even when I'm not here, I have amazing friends like Harmony helping me look for Picasso. My flyers are in the car because I consistently, you know, when we're traveling, we put up the flyers. And then to find out where they put the flyers and all that, you're gonna have to watch her show. Okay, let's get the flyers. Oh my God, I stepped in water. Like I never get wet and then literally, Look at the neighbor being like, what is it you do? <laughs> Unlock car. Oh. <laughs> okay. Where are my Picasso flyers? They're not in here. Here's my baby. Look at how cute he is. So you guys see $1,000 reward. Harmony wanted 100 flyers. I don't know how many are here. There might be 50. Where do you want to post them? Like I was thinking Ventura Boulevard, maybe Sherman Oaks way or what do you think? Towards where they maybe had a sighting. Yeah, we could do that could do too, that. like North Hill. Pet stores? The pet stores won't let you post it, that's the problem. What if we like, bake them? No. The bird stores will, but yeah. they, they have, all the bird stores have it. All the bird stores because literally know. If someone has him, 
He needs to see it. Okay, guys, Harmony has like 50 of these, or oh, at least she's gonna put them around. I can almost send you the file if you wanna print more. Even if they're That's not good. in color, yeah. you know? Or I could even Venmo you money to print them. Don't worry about it. Guess what? Harmony's gonna do a reading right now on Picasso. Okay. So let's see what she finds. All right. Well, I want you to shuffle. Think about Picasso. Okay. Wait a second. I really want you to be mixing them up, so go like this. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> these look like they, these cards look like they have a lot of- um, They're worn in. No, but in a good way. All right. And then you can go like this. You're the one who is connected to him, even though I've been doing lots of readings for you. I'm sniffing him right now. It's amazing, like, the outreach that Picasso has had. I know. Just I love like, him. He's just so cute. I miss him. Oh, I sniff him. Oh, I smell him, so that's... Okay, now cut the deck. Okay. Let me try, guys. Cut the deck. Watch a whole bunch of psychics tell us what the cards mean. See, we got the sun card again. The he's sun card? Good time. Yep. So he's having a good time. Okay, so it's still a good reading, and it's still kind of saying the same thing that they keep telling me, um, which is that he's being taken care of, he's okay, he's not being hurt. Uh, I do see all of your sadness and suffering, the ten of swords that you've been going through. Uh, Picasso is having a good time, you know? He is... <laughs> Without his mommy? He is. Um, you know, I'm not trying to make you feel bad, but I'm just no, saying. No, I want him to suffering. be. No, I don't want him to be suffering. Yeah, I'm just like it's like okay. a kid on vacation, I guess. We've got the sun, which again is showing him having a good time. Is that him having a good time, or is that me because I'm a Leo? Um, no, I think it's him. He okay. keeps showing up, and it's just okay. showing that he's having a good time, you know. But um, justice shows that it's okay. You know, everything is okay. He's being treated fairly. We do have the Seven of Wands, which is about you needing to stand up for yourself and really make a push. We really need to do that. I do see the Page of Swords, which is telling us that we've got to hurry up. We may be getting a message soon. I feel like you're losing a little bit of steam just because you're getting so exhausted by all like, of this. I am because like I follow every lead and like, it could be any bird that they see anywhere. And suddenly I'm in the middle of like, Sherman Oaks with a huge building. And they're like, even if Picasso was there and he was loose, there would be no way to find him. Yeah, but you cannot think like that. Well, I follow every lead though, but I am losing like- Yeah, you can't like, let that happen. And I, I can see that that's happening. It's almost like you're just losing touch with this situation as time goes by, which I don't blame you. But what the cards are saying is that you need to keep being strong. And our last card here is temperance, which means that we do have to be patient. We need to be calm. I believe it's, it is going to work out. Yeah, yeah that I was, really do. I, that was my question. Like, what's that card right there? Um, again, it's urging us to hurry up, to okay. take action right away. So what happens now that I'm gone for a week? Well, you have us here. We're going to be posting flyers. Okay. I mean, we can even put our own numbers on it. I'm totally cool with taking phone calls, emails, whatever. And um, I mean, maybe Jenna can help as well. You know, we'll keep it going. What if you guys find <laughs> Picasso? I want to find him so badly. And I did get the Nine of Cups, which is the wish card. I have received that twice when I've been You're checking so good the cards with this. from Arlene. So I believe that we will find him. You know what's weird about this whole thing? You know when there's like collective consciousness or a bunch of people manifesting things, you're like so, and everyone has a good feeling. I haven't met any psychic, any person that doesn't have a good feeling that I'll find Picasso. That's important. But where's Picasso? Like of all the people, like if anyone found any bird anywhere, like you feel like since it's mine, you would know it's mine, except in my situation, it, it, wherever he is, it's just not happening. It's just so confusing. And you guys ask me like, oh, you seem better. I'm like, totally not better. I just have to deal. No, you gotta deal. And falling apart isn't gonna help anything. So Which you're I doing the right done. thing. We just can't lose steam. We have to keep, okay. keep posting those flyers, getting the word out. Because I believe that 
Whoever has Picasso, this person just needs to find out that Picasso is a loved bird and he's a well-known bird and if he surrenders him, you know, he'll get a reward. So you think he's a good person? Yeah, I think that he's mm -hmm. a fine person. Um, I'm not sure what his intentions are with Picasso. Um, perhaps, you know, it's monetary, I don't know, but if he finds out that, you know, you have a reward, maybe he'll hand Picasso over. Oh, I got another question for you. Yeah. This is strange, but if I was to say to you, like, what do you feel like the guy's name is that has Picasso? And, and there's no right answer. I'm just asking, like, not because I'm going to really look for that guy. Uh, it's just that a lot of people have miraculously given me the same name. I mean, I don't do that. Like, I know, I, I know. I don't do that, but I think Chris. I, I keep oh, thinking you Chris. Me, Chris. Yeah, but I don't, it's probably wrong. I've never, I've never done that before. Okay. <laughs> Watch these guys start harassing every Chris. That they see. That's it. <laughs> but now you're gonna end up in one of uh, Randy's videos, right, Randy? Hi, Randy. Randy. Guys, you gotta follow Randy, okay, on Instagram. I'll put it below. Literally, he makes these video edits out of my videos. Yeah. Oh, but I've seen them. They're crazy. Yeah, he's but really I, good. They're, they're like so. Fun. They're fun. Yeah. Like I don't, I'm die laughing and like one of my friends says it's her goal to be in his video. I'm like, oh well, now I know Harmony's gonna end up in one of them. <laughs> <Awesome. laughs> like he'll literally You're find me on Instagram <laughs> and take you and Sierra. Oh boy. Okay. No, be cool because yeah. like you want to get your show out there, guys. Yeah. So like her show is gonna be amazing because Harmony does some really good work. She's an actress. Yeah. She's been a producer before. She's <laughs> produced um, Halfway House, which, do you know? One day, I told them on a live. It was my first live ever. Yeah. 3,000 people showed up to the live, and I told them about Halfway. I'm like, go, because you told me, can you tell your best? Yeah. I tell them, and then the next day, you're like, guys, it's viral on um, yeah. whatever. And I was like, maybe that's a coincidence. Funny or die, like, it did. Funny or die. I like that show, so. I know. Show. That was fun guys. No, you guys will love show. it. Harmony's in it. She's the star of it I'm in it like a gothic chick and now that you've seen two of us go watch halfway on is it on YouTube? YouTube. Yeah, okay on halfway chicks flips on site. chicks yeah. making flips Page. site. Yeah. yeah, you'll love it So literally you think I'm gonna get Picasso back. I do. I do. Won't that be a story? <sighs> Gotta visualize guys. We can do it. I was thinking what if I had um, kind of like a live where we all visualize Picasso coming back together. But I can't do it alone. Like I need somebody to lead the meditation. Like so, like someone would be live with me in my office, and then the, everyone else would be. Yeah. Like. So yeah, I love that idea. Are you good at leading meditation? Um, maybe. Or should I we find probably, somebody? I don't know. I could look into it. And by the way, Harmony keeps sending me readings through her her texts. Again, guys, I'm blown away by the help and support for Picasso and my goal is like I just want to get him back because I want people like you to know that like like everything you do like keeps me going you know it really does this little bird well tune in to City of Angels when it comes out we'll have it on my Instagram and Sierra's what's your Instagram uh, Harmony Smith at Harmony Smith on Instagram don't forget to follow yay. her yay thank you right yeah and and um Sierra will have. So you guys are gonna have the same episode on both your Instagrams. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Cool. That's gonna be exciting. Look at my phone stalking me. It literally <laughs> said I don't recognize your voice. I'm like, I wasn't asking oh. you to listen to me. Okay. Just like I wasn't trying to talk to you. You know. So. Thank you so much, Harmony. I can't wait to see the episode. I feel like this is perfect timing right now because you guys know that like. I'm literally looking for Picasso. And by the way, Labor Day, I'm doing a meet and greet in Houston. So if you are gonna be around Houston, Texas, write in the comments below and I'll give you more info. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, at Marlene McCohen. Check out this show. I may try to edit this right now and put it up for tomorrow's video because I am so not prepared. <laughs> and so not prepared for tomorrow. And um, guys, if you're seeing this video and you're like wishing that this was the 100,000 special, don't worry. It's obviously not, but don't worry. It's being edited. I put someone else on the task now because 
Like, it, I just, it was a tall order, so Chris is editing it, so it's perfect. You're not gonna miss out. I love you guys so, so much. Bye! I just asked one more time about whether we're gonna find Picasso without the Two of Cups. That is a union. Oh I'm my god, it is. Yeah, that's me and Picasso. Yeah, I have faith. We're gonna find him. Do you know in all my dreams, I'm literally like never not found him in my dreams. Like I've See? always found him in like millions of different ways and then like I'm hugging him. Like there's no way. Like it like my dreams are just not wrong. Usually. Okay. You guys we're gonna find him. Oh. Uh, I know that. Really? You're gonna start filming without me pressing oh it my again? God. <laughs> Do you see this thing? It's like, we want more. <laughs> like, who's behind you? And who's this interested? Like, really? Huh?